$20 billion, 10 years of silence, and one unfinished monument that's daring to rise again. This is Jeddah Tower. Saudi Arabia's attempt to build the world's first skyscraper that reaches one full kilometer into the sky, a structure meant to outshine Dubai's Burj Khalifa, and to prove that no ambition is too high. For years, it stood half-built, frozen in silence. The desert winds howled through empty floors, and people asked the same question again and again. Was this the tallest failure in history? But now, after almost 10 years of stillness, the impossible is moving once again. Cranes are back. Workers are back. The dream is alive. And now the only question left is, how high will it rise? By 2017, the Jeddah Tower was already taller than most skyscrapers on Earth. 250 meters of concrete core reached toward the sky, and the world waited to see the first building that would cross a kilometer. Then, everything stopped. Funding ran out, oil prices crashed, and Saudi Arabia's construction giant, the Bin Laden Group, was hit with corruption probes that shook the nation. The project froze in place. For years, Jeddah's skyline was defined by silence, an unfinished monument standing alone in the desert. Tourists pointed to it from highways. Locals called it the Sleeping Giant. And the question began to echo louder with each passing year. Was this dream dead for good? Then, in 2023, something changed. After years of speculation, the site roared back to life. New contracts were signed, fresh crews were hired, equipment rolled in, and the massive structure began to rise again. By 2025, the desert was buzzing with activity, a heartbeat returning to something once thought lost. For Saudi Arabia, restarting Jeddah Tower wasn't just about finishing a building, it was about proving something bigger. Under Vision 2030, the kingdom is reshaping its future, diversifying its economy and creating symbols that show progress to the entire world. And nothing says progress like a tower that touches the clouds. When this project was first unveiled in 2013, it was called Kingdom Tower. The idea was breathtaking, a vertical city rising 1,000 meters high, 3,281 feet above the Red Sea. Inside, there would be apartments, luxury hotels, offices, restaurants, and observation decks open to the sky. A total of 167 floors stacked into a single point of ambition. But Jeddah Tower wasn't meant to stand alone. It's the centerpiece of a $20 billion district called Kingdom City, a futuristic hub for business and innovation stretching across the northern coast of Jeddah. The tower would be its crown jewel, a shining symbol that Saudi Arabia was not just following the modern world, but helping define it. If you're loving these massive builds, make sure to tap that like button. It helps this story reach more people who geek out over impossible engineering like this. And if you're new here, hit subscribe, because this tower is only one of dozens of mega projects reshaping our planet right now. From the very beginning, engineers knew this wouldn't be a normal skyscraper. To stand a kilometer tall, it had to be a machine built to fight gravity, wind and heat every single second. Underneath the sand lies one of the strongest foundations ever built. A five meter thick raft of solid concrete anchored by 270 massive piles drilled more than 100 meters deep into limestone and gravel. Each one acts like a root, spreading the weight of the tower deep into the earth. But even with that kind of foundation, the desert brings new enemies. At 1,000 meters, the wind doesn't just push, it twists and pulls. So the architects designed something revolutionary a Y-shaped structure with three wings sprouting from a central spine. This design scatters the wind's energy, breaking apart the violent vortexes that can tear buildings apart. And instead of using steel, they turn to ultra-high performance concrete, a mix that doesn't weaken in heat and actually grows stronger over time. It's as if the tower was sculpted from one single block of stone, anchored, unshakable, and made to last a century or more. But the higher it climbs, the harder it gets. Each floor brings new technical challenges, new costs and new risks. Even the tiniest measurement error at the base could mean meters of deviation at the top. At this scale, perfection isn't a luxury, 
its survival. Originally, the Jeddah Tower was expected to cost around $20 billion. Now, experts believe the total could rise to 25 or even 26 billion before completion. Every delay adds pressure, and every day the tower remains unfinished, the world watches and waits. For Saudi Arabia, this is more than a construction project. It's a symbol of transformation, proof that they can build not just for today, but for a future that reaches beyond the horizon. For more than a decade, Dubai's Burj Khalifa has ruled the skyline. At 828 meters tall, it's been untouchable, the world's tallest building by far. But now Saudi Arabia is making its move. Jeddah Tower aims to surpass that record by nearly 200 meters, redefining what we thought a skyscraper could be. It's not just about height, it's about prestige, national pride, and showing the world who leads in the age of mega projects. The race isn't over yet, but for the first time in years, the kingdom's challenger is rising again. If Jeddah Tower reaches completion, it won't just be the tallest building on Earth. It will mark a new era of engineering, a monument to perseverance, innovation and audacity. It would symbolise how far human ambition can reach when technology, vision and willpower converge in one point on the horizon. Each floor would stand as proof that even the harshest environments can be transformed through imagination. The tower would become a beacon on the Red Sea, visible for miles, reminding every visitor that the impossible is only temporary. But if it falters again, it could stand as a reminder that even limitless wealth can't guarantee success. A monument to human ambition and its limits. From its roots buried deep in limestone to its terraces brushing the edge of the clouds, Jeddah Tower embodies resilience. Every beam and every slab of concrete carries the weight of a nation's vision for the future. The structure stands as proof of human persistence and a country's determination to reach higher than ever before. For Saudi Arabia, this build represents more than height. It represents progress, identity and a declaration to the world. The $20 billion tower is climbing once again, racing past the Burj Khalifa toward the sky. Whether it ends in triumph or tragedy, one thing is certain. It will be remembered as one of the boldest architectural gambles of the 21st century. A reminder that history doesn't reward hesitation. It remembers those who dared to build beyond the clouds. So what do you think? Will Jeddah Tower finally reach the sky? or? remain the tallest unfinished dream in history. If you enjoyed this story of ambition and engineering, make sure to like, share and subscribe. Because next time, we're diving into another record-breaking mega-build that's rewriting the limits of what's possible.